Hey guys, and welcome back to Let It Die. Today we're gonna be doing a lot. Uh, no, we're not. <laughs> we're gonna be doing a little bit because I have to pause it and go do some other shit like edit this video because just timing of things were not ideal for me. Anyways, um, I didn't make videos for you guys and now I'm rushing to make videos for you guys. <laughs> Um, anyways, also, I am a utter heat furnace right now, because I have a long sleeve shirt on, first mistake. Second mistake was that I decided to open up this beautiful drink, um, it's a, and it just so happens I have a lot of caffeine and, and maybe be an energy drink, and oh god. Um, and, we're playing a game that's frustrating, so innately you heat up. Okay, enough complaining. Uh, <laughs> the thing I wanted to quickly talk to you guys about, that's a joke, nothing's quick for me, anyways. Um, so essentially, uh, I did something that I've been doing, that I haven't been doing for a while. Um, not really, um, okay. So one of the things that I haven't really been doing, and I'm not sure if you guys were able to see it, um, but it, I haven't been fully reading comments. Um, it's something that I used to do a ton of a ton. Like, I, I, I never missed, uh, reading, replying to every single comment, and only recently have I let that go. Um, I might talk about that in Let's Talk for the reason why I stopped. I stopped replying and reading everything. Um, I, I just basically, whatever popped up on my phone was what I caught. Which I felt like was a good way to filter out some stuff and just kind of, like, a throw the dice who I got to see and etc. But I did heavily, like, stop. Um, and recently I've gotten back into that and that's also why I'm rushing to make videos. Is because I, instead of editing a video that day, I replied to comments. Um, and <laughs> I can't tell you guys how good that is. Um, the reason why I stopped, I'll mention it a little bit here, but essentially, I was starting to get very dependent on comments to push me forward, and I don't like that. I don't like, uh, I'm very mechanical in the way I see, see things, and the idea that my fuel was other people being beautiful human beings and extremely kind was nice, but wasn't, I wasn't comfortable with that, you know what I mean? Like, what happens when... You know, people aren't there, you know what I mean? So, I don't know, I don't like depending on people, it sounds messed up, but it, it, that's just the way I am because, again, what happens when that person maybe isn't there and you just crumble? Like, I, so I took a break because I wanted to make sure that whatever I was doing, I could fuel myself to do it more. So again, if I ever got to the point where maybe my channel got deleted some shit, I don't think that would happen, hopefully never, um, knock on wood, but my point being is that I wanted to kind of distance myself because, again, I felt like I was leaning too heavily on them to make me driven, I guess. Um, so I stopped for a little bit. Um, for I think a month and a half, I stopped. Um, and then, finally, um, I felt like I was in a place where I started to just make videos that I wanted to see, and it's also the, the time when my channel actually skipped up a lot. Point being is that I eventually got, I felt like I was in a place where, again, my fuel was me, it wasn't others. Um, so, I um, went back and replied to the comments, and, and seen them, and really, really seen every single one of them. And it was beyond amazing. It was fan-fucking-tastic, actually. Everyone was saying extremely kind things, like, a lot of- one of the things that I heard that I love so much, um, I heard a lot of guys say it, so I'm not sure if it's a thing in the, like, the Let It Die community and on Reddit or whatever the hell, but it's basically, see you at the top. That's what everyone always ends their sentences with, and I just- I think it's amazing, because in another community that I was following for a while, which is Destiny, um, and I still am. <laughs> People always call themselves Guardian. Like, uh, we're looking for Guardians to do, like, to mess around in our raid. Who wants to come in? Like, people just call themselves Guardians because that's, that's who you were in the game. Um, as much as some people could find that cheesy, I always felt that really cool as, like, a community-driven term. Like, that you would immediately not think anything of, but then when someone else hears it, they're like, what the fuck? And you're like, oh, that's, I guess that's our thing. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> and that was really cool to me. But anyways. And then again, um, in the last video, I mentioned people were telling me about the Power Stomper armor. Power Stomper <laughs> armor. And that was amazing and fantastic. And then people telling me that, like, um, certain things, like how to how to do better and all those all those things. Um, one of the things that you guys are saying was, uh, a lot of you guys are saying, always carry around three of these items. Um, these uh, groggy mushrooms. I knew what they did. Essentially, they allow you to instant kill anybody. Any uh, fighter, I guess. Not, not any boss, but... Like, the way I can bat that, I don't know, this thing is basically an instant kill weapon. So you're saying always have an instant kill weapon on your character because, I don't know, I feel like there should be, there, you shouldn't need the instant kill weapon, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like in order to have that much damage, it's a bit stupid, because literally, it's it's not even an instant kill weapon, this is a win button. Like, it, just to say instant kill is talking about damage, when in actuality, this thing just allows you to win or survive, <laughs> and that's the crazy part. To me... 
it's a patch for a problem, not a solution to a, I think, an issue in the game. Um, oh, also, um, one of the things you guys were saying that uh, I think this game is, is hard. Um, I don't think it's hard so much as it, it is brutally unforgiving. I think there's a difference he heavily with that. Um, I don't think this game deserves the, the, uh, the I guess, title as a hard game because I don't think it earns it really. Um, I know that could be weird, but like... For instance, games like uh, Dark Souls, I bring that up a lot because it's a very hard game. It's it's known to be a difficult game. Um, the reason why it's difficult to me is because there is an option for success. Um, and that option is only there because you can dash, you can dodge, you can um, backstab someone. You have a thousand different weapon tapes that both defend and have different ways of attacking. Um, and yes, this game does have that, but it doesn't have the other like combat-driven things. So to me to say it's hard is... Is, I don't know, I, th I think it's giving it too much, <laughs> you know what I mean? I feel like things that are difficult have the implication ugh, implication that they are still doable. But again, like I said, the groggy shroom, some of you guys say, were saying that that's like a fix, when to me that's a no way a fix, that's a no way a fix at all. Like you're, you're basically saying, here's one item in the game that just so happens to be an instant kill bu button, that doesn't make it the problem, like you shouldn't need the instant kill button, there should be a way for you to handle that person without having to carry around, like, the key to solving the problem. I feel like you should be able to solve it with with the tools that you already have. Maybe that's crazy. But yeah, I would say this game is unforgiving. Um, a very unforgiving at times, because a lot of it is dependent on, <laughs> dependent on RNG, which can be very brutal, <laughs> which can be like, hey, guess what? We're not giving you anything. Um, and that's, that's a problem. Or it could be like, hey, guess what? Um, you just got, like, four haters after you that are maxed out in the best type of armor and that's one of the things I also hear I hear pride come into this game quite a little bit like people being like um, I heard one comment say not in a negative way but they were basically saying that um, in Dark Souls at least there's the uh, invaders are, are humans but in this game you're fight the fighters that are coming after you you can outplay them uh, <laughs> I'm not sure of that I don't like that to me is completely untrue because in Dark Souls, when a person is fighting you, yes, it could be stupid, but also you can shut that off. I think, if I'm not mistaken, you go in Dark Souls, you shut off the online mode, and it's fine. It works. So I'm not sure about that. But anyways, the other thing is that um, in this game, a fighter could be decked out in the best tier of armor, and you could be, a, I don't know, maybe you're a new character around level 20, and you're like the best, right? But you have that grade 2 fighter because you're just getting in the game. Whatever. I don't care if you have a, an innate ability to play games, but... Um, that's your situation, and you get a fighter that is extremely stronger than you, decked out in the best armor, you can't do a damn thing, you can't hit him more, it does not matter. And you're in a level that doesn't have, like, a, a, a roof to fall off of. What are you gonna do? And that you're, you're outplaying him, is running from him in terror to just get away from him? That's not outplaying, <laughs> that, that's you running like a terrified person because you have no hope. Um, and that's the one thing I wish the designers would offer you sometimes, is hope. The, I, the chance that you could win, you know what I mean? Like in Dark Souls, when you backstab someone who has a fuck ton of health, it's the best feeling ever, because you're like, you just got fucked, dude. <laughs> like, I, you're so big and tall, but if I hit you in the right spot, you crumble to pieces. It's a good feeling. Anyways, the point that I was trying to get across is, um, I loved reading the comments and just seeing what everyone said. I still haven't gotten to every one of the videos I wanted to, like, catch up on when it comes to comments. Um, but I just want to make sure you guys knew that I seen them. Um, and I was, and I love them to tears. Um, but, what we're going to be doing today, because <laughs> this is a video, and that's what we're doing, um, is we're going to be doing something not that special. I think I've done it on many videos, but it's the one thing, it's like basically my farming route right now. We're going to go to floor 21, um, and go to Kawabi, this place right here, um, and we're going to keep farming for black metals. Again, I need DOD black metal really, really badly. Um, no, I don't. Actually, yes, I do. I need, the, need it for the power stomper armor. Anyways, um, also the reason why this is my route is because I'm always going to need black metals as well as I need, um, um, materials, which on these side floors, I guess, floors that are not elevator floors, there's a, always, to, for me at least, there's a lot of resources. Um, so I also get my massive bolts and metals and shit like that, <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, so to floor 21 we go. Um, I, normally, I would take a back seat and kind of, uh, you know, just like end the, just make an update of the update to let it die, and that's be it. Um, I wouldn't be like, hey guys, let's go, let's go do the farming route I've already done. It's just I, I kind of fucked up with videos this week, and I, I recorded for a long ass period of time, and I finished editing the videos, realizing that I didn't really want to split them up into a bunch. 
So I ended up making them all kind of contained, but in doing so, I don't have any videos for any other day. So instead, I just, instead of making a lot of videos, I made two big ones, and I'm like, fuck, damn it, that's not how daily uploads work, you idiot. And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> fair, ah. Uh. So yeah, again, reason why I'm just a boiling pot of hell right now is uh, I have the, the fucking energy drink, and ah, it's, I'm so goddamn warm. It's also 11, and I'm st I'm halfway done the thing, and I already don't sleep that well at all. So I did something, and then I was like, "Oh shit! I should have did it quicker, and we would have been okay." Did it quicker. We're we're an intelligent bunch here on the channel, and by we're I mean me. It just plays into the fact that again, not the most intelligent. <sighs> ah, my fucking throat. Also, getting sick. See, you know, I'm 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 a whiner. I am just a little bitch. I'll be honest. I'm like a little whiner. I shouldn't say that, because then that implies bitch as, like, a woman, and then the woman is in, like, a lesser per- That's fucked up, me. Like, calling someone a pussy, but then it's like, well, why is that any less? And I'm like, listen, guy, I don't know why it is. I just said it for so long, and it's fucking- I'm sorry. I really am sorry. It's always the dude who says it, you know what I mean? It's always, like, the guy who's like, why are you doing that? And I feel like a woman should be like, fucking, tell me to stop, and then you're the one. I mean, I guess, sure, but you're not wrong, <laughs> but you are an asshole. When was your guy's last I ate horrible shit <laughs> day? Today, I had I woke up, had my mass my mass gainer. Shut up. <laughs> it's basically, it's just a giant protein shake with a ton of calories because I forget to eat meals. Um, and I'm started working out recently, and I'm gonna fucking die if I don't eat food. That damn it. Um. So yeah, I woke up, had a good amount of just like syrup, syrupy liquid, and it's just awful. Honestly, it's really gross. But I drank it, and it's done. And then I can make videos and the whole nine yards. Crude oil. I mean, yeah, I guess the one stomper armor, whatever the hell, uh, requires that. Anyways, um, and then I didn't eat anything for the whole day. And then, guess what? Fucking Wendy's. <laughs> Wendy's and an energy drink is the thing I ate. So we're killing it, boys. So I'm, ah, not the best decision I've ever made. I literally just have bile in my stomach right now. <laughs> and grease. Hence why there's my forehead's like a... <clears throat> so by the way, uh, the best part about doing this and like you know going to this extent to farm, like in battle, not in battle war, <laughs> um, in Borderlands, you go to the said location, you kill the boss, that's it, right? You're good. And if it doesn't drop anything, you can quickly just you know back out, jump back in. The bosses respawn, you go at it. No, this this farming in this game is you got to go to two different levels, go to two loading screens, then come back. I hope to God it's there. But also, there's a bunch of these fun little implications that could just mess you the fuck up. Like, uh, maybe a, j a fucking crazy good hater who's high level uh, following you and ripping off your face. That can happen. It's not ideal, but it can happen. Is this gonna be the... Nope, it is not. We're gonna do this. I'm here, dude. Shit! Well, that was no fair play. Oh, well. Oh, goddamn... Fucking rain shit always gets me. Oh, that's a big issue, me. You stupid, real dumb. Anyways, also on the list of things to fuck you up, just the level layout could be where like a bunch of people are in blocking the hallways, and you're gonna get fucked that way. And it's just like, oh, eat, uh, eat that. Well, not a good time. Shit, I went the wrong, wrong way. Not just the wrong way, the wrong, wrong way. Oh, also eat this. Eat, I should have done that from the beginning. Oh, by the way, um, can you destroy a pill bug, a golden pill bug, and if, if you do, what does he give you? Like, does he give you two lives instead of the one? That'd be pretty fucking sweet. Oh, by the way, the best combo that I found is a poison weapon and a fire weapon. Uh, the reason why is because a fire weapon destroys the armor on the, uh, the target, which becomes super, like, needed. Oh, I just fucking did a loop, didn't I? Son of a bitch. But yeah, the fire becomes extremely needed. Um, because again, the, it's, it's, I think it's, it has like a high damage tick towards armor. I don't know, it just strips them of their armor. So that you can actually start doing damage that's not gonna make your weapon just break on impact. Um, so, the fire's excellent. Now why is the poison good in the slightest? Well, the poison's great because any AI is really stupid in the sense that they will prioritize vomiting the poison out than anything else. There. Yeah, you're a horrible problem. There's some resources usually to the right. This could be bad. Faster swing. Uh, nothing's over there. We have my fists. Um, but yeah, the poison, um, any AI will prioritize vomiting up their guts, um, than fighting you, and it's excellent. Uh, so you, essentially, all you need to do is infect them, back up a little bit, um, they'll be like, oh, I have the window of opportunity to vomit and get it out of my system, and then you just run right back at them, and then you start killing them. It's great. Rosewood! 
Yes, I thought I could maybe make like one more video real quick. Ah, uh, my voice is so fucking bleeding right now. Ah, <laughs> ah, <laughs> ah, <laughs> uh, which way is it? Not that way, great. So it's literally the last place I looked, it was here. Honestly, we needed something to take up some time, so I mean like... <laughs> Aha, asshole. <laughs> Hey, dude. Yeah, I thought that, I wish there was a way to like counter that because you only really can just take the damage. You gotta like block against those people. Anyways, um, D O D. Yeah. I was where I was gonna get milk, which I've wanted for so long, but at this point I have a decent amount of it, so I don't really need it. And we both miss. Oh, I thought you missed. Well, see, look at that. That fire damage. It just, that weapon hurts. I just don't want to deal with it anymore. Oh, by the way, um, I have a question. Do you guys know if jackals spawn, the, the like requirement for jackals to spawn, either you're on the level for a long ass time, or another way you can get them to spawn is by killing everyone in the level, or <laughs> is it both of those? Like both of those need to be checked off. So both all enemies in the level need to die, and then you need to also wait until they spawn for a while. Or is it literally just your time on the level can be too much and then they spawn? I'm starting to think, I think you need the the, you have to kill everyone on the level and then you have to wait and then they'll spawn I thought it was just you ha it's like a negative to being on a level for too long But then I started remembering and I was like I could have sworn I paused the game like just waiting in the, like a dark corner somewhere on the level um, And then coming back and just going through it all fine. Maybe that's a false memory that I made I don't know, <laughs> but I want to know if it is or not. I imagine you guys have the info ah, Man my voice. I, f I feel like something punched me in the throat not really, because I would feel like I didn't have any air, and instead I just have a scratch. Just punch in the throat sounded a bit better. My drama queen. I don't want to talk about it. Also, yeah, a lot of guys shit on my, my method. <laughs> my method of running through the level. When you guys are not here, I do actually prioritize killing them and going slow, but I just don't think it's fun to watch someone, like, just creak through a level. It's like, come on, guy. Let it happen already. Because normally, like, when we were doing the level... Actually, no, when we were doing, like, the high-level play, um, getting up to, like, the 20, the 39th floor, um, I did have to run as well. Not because I, I, I wanted to, because I had to, <laughs> because I'm, all, the, all the enemies would just destroy me. But I'm pretty sure we can make the Power Stomper pants, which would replace these pants, which, honestly, I'm starting to think I should just, like, just upgrade one thing. Doesn't matter what that is, just upgrade it a lot, because I feel like I'm jumping around too much. Like, first we made the, the, uh, boxer pants, and, like, the... The, what is it called? The, the puncher pants? It was something like that. Anyways, and then the next thing we made was uh, the, the leather pants, like the biker leather pants. And then we're gonna make the uh, fucking, uh, the power sniper pants. Let's hope they're the better ones. <clears throat> they may not look as great, so that's why that was also a big key thing. It's a lot of people were like, if you don't mind looking real fucking dumb, <laughs> these pants are for you. Because they look real, not pants, the whole outfit looks really stupid. It's like the most bright flamboyant, like... Just crazy looking pink shit all over your character. But at the end of the day, if you gotta be fabulous to win, I'm not gonna go against it. But, I'm just saying, you look kinda, like you're kinda bright. You're not sneaky. <laughs> you're like real bright. But we can go ahead and make, I think, unless we're missing something. No, we can make the power stop of hand. Uh, oh, oh shit. Oh, we can't. Yeah, we need two of those. No, we need two hemp. That's the problem. Shit. Again, we already have a good chest piece. It's It gives us 800 something. I believe this gives us a thousand when we level up enough. So yeah. Um, also, this one has a negative towards nothing. What does the power stomper have? I thought it also had. Oh, it has it has a, a bonus, and not just like nothing. Cool. It's negative to uh, electricity because you know we always face that electricity. <laughs> Seen it twice in the entire game. Mostly just in those traps, and that's it. But why? And then we have to wait to, to yeah. Um, oh, also. Um, one of you guys were asking uh, something. I don't remember exactly what it was, but it was something to to the degree in which Oh, that's what it was. It was um people were like laughing <laughs> laughing at my minimal uh, Space in my chest. I have 160 space in my chest uh, Because I'm not paying for anything and that's kind of the root of the issue <laughs> that I'm not paying for I haven't put any money in the game and I want to beat it Kill the final boss to show that it's possible to like do it without having to dump so much money into it you just have to jump so much time. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. So, yeah. That's what I'm trying to do. When you guys actually were like, hey, that's what he's doing. And I was like, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Anyways. 
Also, I got this. Um, it's... Yeah, holy shit. <laughs> it gives you a lot of defense, but then again, I think that's a, like an illusion. Because it's also extremely weak against certain things. So I think when something is weak against it, I'm not sure if that increases the damage of that projectile or if it just doesn't protect it. I think when it has a negative, it means that you're going to hit harder with whatever weapon that is. Well, we could actually check because that one, we got hit with a bunch of arrows. Does this thing have a high resistance against bullets? Our chest piece? No, it is a negative to, to ranged weapons. So that's... What the fuck? It, it has a negative to everything <laughs> except fire and... Seems shitty. <laughs> Seems really bad. Anyways, guys, um, I wish I could be like, hey, we're gonna go do some more, but I kind of think that's it. Um, yeah, <laughs> shit. Not the most stuff happened, but essentially, I just want to update you guys, let you guys know that I read your comments. And I know that maybe sound weird, but to me, it was really nice to see that. Um, as well as uh, uh, just stuff to update you guys on where we're, where we're at in the series. I feel like for reading the comments, a lot of you guys watch this series in particular because the videos are just by nature really long because I have to explain things and I want to explain things and I want to like go at a slow pace but at the same time when we get into actual like playing I like to go 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 <laughs> I don't really like to take my time I like to get it on with um but it seems like a lot of you guys watch these like in the background almost like as if it's like a podcast or some shit which made me laugh because I was just like I mean I guess <laughs> like yeah I could see that I can see how people would go about doing that. Why am I here? Um, oh, also, yeah, we have those weapons I didn't show you guys. I do have them on the character. i just not using them because, again, stupid. <laughs> why, why would you use these weapons? I have no idea. Um, again, if they one hit a boss, I get it. If they don't, then it's no, there's no point. <laughs> Zero point to having them. Um, but yeah, they are nothing special. They're just the same shit. So you can just use a rage thing on them. and oh, I can't even channel my rage. Maybe you need all your rage to do it. Weird. Because I could do it with that one, but if I switch back to it, it's not satisfied. <laughs> it's like, no. <laughs> Weird. Um, anyways, that brings us to the end of the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, as always. That has been Let It Die. Just a quick kind of update for the character. I'm still progressing. I'm still trying my ass off. But again, some days, RNG is an asshole to you, and you just can't get the one thing you want. And then that kind of kills it for you, but then you come back. As, uh, again, the similarities to an abusive relationship is really uh, stupidly similar. Anyways, guys, that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you so much for supporting the channel here on YouTube and or on Patreon. Thank you so much. There's a subscribe button above me as well as two videos to my right. Thank you, guys, and bye.